Hello, this is Michelle at Dasami Bookworm Podcast, and this week is a very exciting event. We are at the Edinburgh International Book Festival, but it's a particular event we're going to chat about today. It's the fellowship meeting hosted by Publishing Scotland. I'm delighted to welcome Marion Sinclair. Great to be on your podcast, Michelle. Thank you so much for inviting me. It's my pleasure. Well, Publishing Scotland has been so supportive of our company throughout the years, and it's such a valuable membership. Part of what you uh, provide for us is the fellowship meetings. Would you please tell us more about it? Sure. So this is the eighth year of the International Publishers Fellowship. It started in 2015, and then we had a bit of a break for COVID. This is where we invite between eight and ten international publishers over to Scotland for a week for a series of meetings, pitchings, author lunches. Um, We take them to Edinburgh, Glasgow, Inverness. And the object really is it's kind of part of our internationalisation activity and part of our kind of internationalisation strategy, which is to kind of make Scottish publishing face outwards, to have an international outlook and to kind of break out beyond the UK. So this is really one of our most practical I think solutions, rather than meeting people at book fairs, um, which can often be very rushed, we are bringing people to Scotland, it just gives them a bit more time, they're here for the entire week, and they just get a mixture of professional, writer, um, cultural insights into Scotland that we hope will prove memorable and give them a bit of a background and a context to buying Scottish books in the future. I think one of the most important aspects of it is the fact that it's a one-to-one presentation so that you can meet someone on that level, whereas at book fairs and festivals, it tends to be so busy and such a buzz, as we always love anyway. Uh, What is the most important part, do you think, for this? I think I think that you have kind of nailed it there that 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 one to one that kind of more relaxed setting in which the Scottish publisher can chat uh, obviously they're there to kind of pitch books and there will be some very specific new books that they will want to do maybe there's backlist as well but there's other opportunities throughout the week just to kind of meet them socially have a chat and continue that relationship because as you know in publishing it's all about relationships people buy books from publishers that they trust that they know um, they know their lists they know who they are they know their taste it's kind of a shorthand in a way and we, we think this is just the beginning of that relationship So I think since 2015 we've had about 70 publishers who have come to Scotland. I don't think those publishers would have come to Scotland to meet the industry in that way. I think they all go to the London Book Fair and they would stop at London. So the most valuable thing for us really is to bring them up and to see the Scottish publishers in situ, to see the landscapes, to see the cities, to hear the accents. You just get more of a feel for the place um, that you don't really get at a book fair. And what you, what you were saying about that, that one-to-one, it is a really people-focused industry and people are buying from people that they trust and whose, trace, whose taste they, they trust over, over many years. And, and that, that personal relationship is very much one-to-one. It's, it's you and the individual. And when that individual maybe moves on to, a, to another company, you still have that relationship. So it's less impersonal and we think more more effective because of that. I think the publishing industry is all about relationships and it's more important because it is such a challenging industry which I always say. So uh, just this last comment what would you like to say about the Edinburgh International Book Festival? So pleased that the Edinburgh International Book Festival is in a new venue. I think it's recovered some of its old joie de vivre. It's got tents, it's got the Spiegel tent. We're on grass, there's lots of light. I'm really personally delighted to see it back there. It's been full of people, it's lively, we've got kids back again, we've just got more of the fun. And I think really with the book festival, it's more than just going to listen to authors. It's more of, you are kind of wandering into a book village where people appreciate books. And I mean, we get that um, in bookshops, but but this is a very, this is a very different thing. This is a very unique thing. You get the chance to see world-class authors up close and they're signing books for you and so on. It's a really special experience for our, um, for our writers, for our publishers, and then more importantly, for our readers. 
Marianne, thank you for taking the time to chat with us today. Uh, you've probably heard a little bit noises here and there, but we do everything live, what we love to do. So thank you again, Marianne. You're very welcome. Thanks. Great to talk to you, Michelle. Bye. And so it's Michelle. We're meeting the fellows. They'll introduce themselves and what they think of this event. Hi, I'm Pia from Sweden, and I think this is really a marvelous occasion to meet different agents and publishers and everyone from Scotland. I'm really looking forward to learning more about Scotland. Hi, I'm Elise from France. I've been really enjoying myself here. This is my first time in Scotland. I get to meet amazing publishers and agent authors. So, so far, it's been amazing. Hi, I'm Gloria, and I work for a Chinese publishing house. Um, and it's really exciting to be here today. It's been a great day because we got the chance to meet publishers and agents that we have not met before. And it's really exciting. So looking forward to the next events. Hi, I'm Lena from Finland. All the same about, you know, it's been great to seeing all the uh, publishers, agents and authors as well. So I'm very much looking forward to the rest of the week. And I wish to thank you all for taking time from the celebrations as they can hear from the background noise to join in Jasami Bookworm Podcast. So thank you. I am having the best time being part of the Publishing Scotland Fellowship. It is so amazing. I, you know, when I had entered publishing, I was worried that I wouldn't be able to fulfill my love of travel um, compared to some of the other careers I was thinking about. And then when I found out about this fellowship, it was, I mean, it was just a no-brainer. I had to do it. And... I am just loving everyone that I'm meeting. It's honestly reinvigorating my love for literature and books. And it's there's a lot to be said about getting out of your usual environment. And it, I feel like it's breathing new life into my love of the industry and why I'm here, why I got into the industry in the first place. So I am so, so grateful for the experience and have a lot that I can take away from it already. And it's only day two. Hello, Simpson Monroe. What do you think of the uh, Publishing Scotland reception? I think it's actually been very good uh, celebrating our 50th anniversary this year. Uh, it's been very well presented and the sponsors have done Publishing Scotland proud. Thank you. She's so... Hello, I'm Louise. I am from LBA Books. I'm a literary agent and I've been here um, pitching to all the international fellows about all of the exciting books and authors that we have coming up this uh, next year. So thank you very much because we um, wish to advertise everyone at the Publishing Scotland Fellowship event. So thank you for taking the time to introduce yourself. You're welcome. It's been a total pleasure. Thank you. <laughs> As the go-to cover designer for Jasami Publishing, how do you feel about tonight's event? I think tonight's been a great event. I've really enjoyed chatting to everyone and the cake was very delicious. And that is Joy Dakers, who we go to for the majority of our covers. Who is fabulous. Thank you. And so that was a taste of the event of the fellowship program that is hosted by Publishing Scotland and then ending with the reception. It was a fantastic day and while I say cheerio for now and wishing you a sunny day, there is more to come from the Edinburgh International Book Festival.